now. We're back from our yeah. another science experiment in my kitchen or my dining room. Um, so for this experiment, we need milk, dish soap, and food coloring. And, and we have some little plates to work with. So what we're going to do, it's called a milk science experiment. No. And we're going to try to mix colors and do a milk science experiment using these three it's ingredients. It's actually called. What's it actually called? What? Oh, mixing color science experiment. So we yeah. are going to mix colors. So we have our primary colors, our three main colors. Do you know what color this is? Yellow. Yellow. Do you know what color this is? Red, my favorite color. Red, his favorite color. Do you and know what color this blue. is? Blue. Also my favorite color. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to put a little bit of milk in each of these little plates. Just a little bit, not too much. So it doesn't want to go. Can you see that? So it goes on the ground. A little bit of don't milk. It. You don't want it to overflow. You are absolutely right. So it doesn't use too much milk, so we're not wasting too much milk, which is nice. Okay. We only have four bottles. So we are going to try to make new colors using our three colors. So we're going to mix Take red it. and red yellow and find out what color comes out of it. And what, what do you these? think happens if we mix what red and these? yellow? Yeah. What happens if we mix red and yellow? What do you think, Leo? What's going to happen? It make green. It'll make green? Let's find out. Okay, so what you do is you take a f your food coloring and you put in a couple drops all over your milk. Okay? And then you use these to mix. No, we don't quite mix with those. So I put some yellow in there. I'm going to put some red. Okay, let me show you. Nope, hold on. So I put just a few drops on there. Okay. Now, we're going to mix it. Nope, not quite. We're not going to mix it ourselves. Let's see. So you're going to take a Q-tip or you can just drop the dish soap right in there. I like to use the Q-tip so I can be a little more controlled with it. So we're gonna cover this with soap, like so. And then watch what happens when we touch the colors with the Q-tip. Oh my gosh, do you see that? It's mixing all by itself. I don't have to move the Q-tip, it's doing it by itself. And what color is it mixing? What does red and yellow make? What does that look like, Leo? What color does that make? Pink. It and makes orange. Oh, but we don't have orange. We don't have orange. We made it with red and yellow. Okay, and let's white. try our next one. Ah, ah. So, with our next one, we are going to mix... Sit down, Leo. Red and blue and see what color we get. So I'm going to do the same thing. We are going to drop in a few drops of each one. So there's a few block drops of red. We'll do a few drops of blue. Whoa, bubbles. And then Leo here, you can go ahead and stick it in there and see what it does. Hold it still. You don't mix it yourself. You just hold it in there like such and it goes all by itself. Look at it. Look at that. It swirls around and mixes all by itself. Let me try. Let go. You just hold it still. Can you see it mixing? You see it mixing glass? I think we might need a little more soap. There we go. Watch, you can lift it up. So if you don't want to use the Q-tip, you can just drop the soap right in there and it'll go by itself. See it moving all by itself and Amazing. mixing all. Just a dot, just a dot, just a dot. It mixes all by itself. And what color is red and blue making? 
What color is it making, Leo? Do you see it making a color? Yes, it's making black. Purple. That's purple. Purple. And it has black. Red and blue mixed together makes purple. No, it's purple blackish. It looks dark to you? It's a dark purple? Yeah. So okay. I so we have one more we can do. Purple. So we did, we did red and yellow, and we made orange. We did red and blue, and we made purple. Let's do blue and yellow. So we're going to do blue a few yellow. drops of yellow. Let's not, let's try it without the Q-tips this time, Leo. I'm going to try it a new way. And a few drops of blue. And this time, let's just drop the, a few drops of dish soap in there without a Q-tip and see what happens. Ready? Hold yes. on, let me get my camera ready so we can see it. Ready? Get that. Whoa, oh, look at it go. Let's do one bubble. Mm, popped. Okay. Let it mix. Boop. Ready? Let's do another drop and see what it does. Nothing. It's not mixing? Uh-oh. Maybe we need the Q-tip. Yeah, that's why. Okay, no, leave that Q-tip's used. We need a clean Q-tip. Uh-oh, you put some orange in there. Let's get a clean Q-tip, Leo. Okay. It's still moving a little bit by itself. That one's dirty, Leo. We're going to use a clean side. Mm, do it. Okay, mm. I get a different Q-tip. <laughs> you see it going? And what color does yellow and blue make? Green. So we have green, purple, and orange with our three colors. That was kind of fun. Now for the last one, we are just going to do a rainbow. So I'll put a few drops of each one in there and we'll see how it works. Leo went to go get some clean Q-tips for us. I got a clean, clean Q-tip. Thank you, Leo. Okay, so we're going to do a rainbow one. Are you ready for this? You can do the Q-tip, but remember to just hold it down straight. Don't wiggle it to mix it because it will mix all by itself. Okay, hold on. Let me get the camera ready so we can see it. We're going to mix all three colors together and watch the rainbow. Okay, ready? Put your Q-tip in there. Don't move. Oh my gosh, look at it go all by itself. Totally gonna make brown. You think it'll make brown if you mix them all together? Oh, don't move it. Just sit still. Let it swirl by itself. It's making green. Green is what I meant. Okay, pull it out. Put a little more soap on your Q-tip. No, you have some soap right here. And then we'll try it again. Watch this. It's going up. The oh, it didn't work that time. I was going. There's too much stuff that I'm going up in the q -tip. That's crazy! Look at it go. Did you know that? Hmm? Got it! Go! It's still moving. Oh, sorry, my camera was messed up. It's still moving. Look at it. <laughs> Let's mix it. Well, it's a fun science experiment. Not too messy, if you're careful. Give it a try. See what colors you can make. Enjoy. Bye.